Welcome everybody. The Goodwood Festival of Speed is one of the most famous hill climb events in the world and the 2021 event is one of the best yet. Here are a few of the cars that debuted at Goodwood. The Lotus Emira. Lotus showcased the new car in a long time, the Emira, the last of the internal combustion engine sports cars before the brand goes on to become fully electric. It's powered by either a supercharged Toyota engine or the monstrous AMG four-cylinder turbo with over 400 horsepower and a dual-clutch transmission. The Aston Martin Valkyrie The long-awaited Valkyrie was launched by Aston, powered by a Cosworth V12 and a Rimac hybrid system. Land Rover Defender V8 Land Rover belted around Goodwood in their new supercharged V8 powered Defender 110 and with it brought back sport to the sport utility vehicle. Toyota GR86 Toyota finally exhibited their newest addition from the Gazoo Racing Garage, the second generation 86 powered by a Subaru Boxer engine in a rear wheel drive layout. Ineos Grenadier The British brand Ineos debuted their Land Rover Defender-inspired Grenadier SUV. One of the three owners of the Mercedes-AMG Petronas Formula 1 team also competes in professional cycling, with the Grenadier being their official support vehicle. Lamborghini SC V12 You can't have an event without Lambo in it. They showed off their prototype Essenza SC V12 a track-only hypercar with limited production of 40 units worldwide. The car is powered by a glorious 6.5-litre V12 and is mated to a 6-speed sequential manual transmission. BMW 2 Series Coupe BMW unveiled their longer, wider, sportier 2022 2 Series Coupe with angrier styling, new powertrains and thankfully a small kidney grill. Porsche Cayenne GT Turbo Porsche also debuted their super-fast GT Turbo variant of the super SUV Cayenne with its revolutionary tungsten carbide 10-pot braking system. Alfa Romeo Giulia GTA The Italian mark Alfa Romeo also launched their mad-fast Giulia GTA with a tuned 2.9-litre bi-turbo V6 with 540 horsepower. It's been jointly developed by Alfa Romeo and Sauber Engineering. Maserati MC20 The spiritual successor to the 2004 MC12, the Maserati MC20 is the brand's newest supercar and is powered by a twin-turbo V6 churning out 630 horsepower and 730 newton meters of torque. It will rival the likes of the Lamborghini Huracan and Ferrari F8 Tributo. Ferrari SF90 Aperta Ferrari's newest hybrid convertible after the LaFerrari is the SF90 Aperta. Powered by the same powertrain like the Coupe, it features an all-aluminium convertible hardtop and is the world's most powerful convertible roadster. Lamborghini Huracan STO Powered by a naturally aspirated V10, the Lamborghini Huracan STO is the culmination of Lamborghini's Quadra Corse heritage and is poised to be the best rendition of the Huracan yet with design elements from the Miura and Sesto Elemento. Scuderia Cameron Glickenhaus SCG 007 The World Endurance Championship just got its newest entrant in the Le Mans hypercar class with Scuderia Cameron Glickenhaus De debuting their new SCG 007. It's powered by a 3.5 litre petrol powered V8 and will compete with the hybrid Toyota GR010 in Le Mans and Spa. The McLaren Artura. The Artura is the British brand's latest hybrid supercar and has a V6 and battery electric powertrain, both being McLaren firsts. What's more exciting is the active aero and the scissor style doors. Thanks for watching. Do like, share, and subscribe. 
You can also check out the original Goodwood Festival of Speed video from the link in the description. Thank you and see you again.